Community Contest and AR Masks today on Gods of Boom News. Giveaway at the end of the video. Hi, Stennis, not here. It's Maya, also a Gods of Boom community manager, and welcome to the fourth edition of Walking Dead News, the most brutal and merciless news outlet yet. We're in the midst of our epic Walking Dead season, but we've also got tons of other important stuff to discuss. So today we're talking about the progress in specializations, community contests and new AR masks, and upcoming game activities. Let's break it down! If you've been following the development of specializations in the game, you must have seen our roadmap that shows our plans to roll out certain features. We're happy to say that we're almost at the end of the line and are ready to present you with the final versions of specializations. What we have now is the meta we had planned all along. So let's take a look at the four different specs. Assault. This is the backbone of any team close range and mid range. The assault is capable of dealing huge amount of damage to multiple targets. Sniper. The name says it all. This pack allows you to keep your distance and take down key enemy targets while staying safe on the other end of the map. Smart and cool headed. Support. Stay a little behind the front line and provide covering fire for your teammates. This spec relies heavily on good positioning and sticking with your team. Recon. The newest addition that lets you play with a sniper rifle and a shotgun. Lack of mid-range weapons means only one thing. You won't see recon out in the open too much. So give the complete set of specializations a go. Play around with it, test different loadouts and record the gameplay. Please share your thoughts and videos on the best use of specializations on our social media. For more detailed information on specializations, follow the link in the description. And now, community news! The Walking Dead event doesn't end with the game modes and fairs. For instance, we're holding several contests on different platforms right now, and one of them is a costume contest. Just like we had back in the days of Trejo Tournament. Remember? Here's how it works. Come up with a costume, make it from whatever materials are available to you, put it on and take a photo, post it on Instagram, then add the GOBXTWD cosplay hashtag and your in-game ID to the description. The prizes are amazing, to say the least. Like a year's subscription to the official loot box, the Walking Dead supply drop, fragments of event weapons, Daryl's costume, season pass and more. Now, there are other contests as well, and not all of them have already started. So, if you're not much of a cosplayer, check out the link in the description. We have an article about all the event contests, which will let you show off your strong sides. Or just use the in-game schedule to find the info you need. Another cool feature? We've got beautiful new AR masks on Instagram. Just go to the AR tab and see all four of them in action. Try on the deputy hat straight from the series for a truly authentic look. Put on the whisperer mask to fool the walkers around you into thinking you're one of them. Get a taste of being the big one and make sure to open your mouth to check for bad breath. Finally, become a walker yourself with reanimation. Being undead isn't half bad, right? Check them all out. Make your own stories and mention at Gods of Boom. We'll repost the best ones to our official channel. The fame awaits. Now let's look at some upcoming in-game activities. The second break is upon us, but that doesn't mean there is less fun in the game. First of all, you got some new daily challenges to complete. Tackle all three each day and you'll get the guaranteed fragments of reanimator pants. Second. We've got a new brawl coming up. Last stand. You have one life only, and there are endless waves of walkers and raiders coming your way. You simply can't eliminate them all. You can only survive longer than the rest of the gunslingers. Last but not least, we've got battle cases coming up with the epic Colossus helmet. Once activated, 
all incoming damage from enemy consumables turns into additional armor for you. Time this baby right, and one good activation of the Colossus can turn the game around in a second. And it can be used in the support and recon specs. And now, the giveaway. We asked you to come up with your backstory for the third team in Gods of Boom. And your stories were extremely dark and extremely good. Let me read you the beginning of Jack Reacher's story. It was a cool, windy afternoon in the town of Thintiana, Kentucky. After 10 days of clearing a path of walkers, our heroes, Gods of Boom players and Daryl, stumble on an abandoned farm, canned food and gallons of water scattered on the barn floor with walls blooded in red W's. Spooky, right? Now as for today's giveaway. You proved yourself to be quite the writers, so now it's time to try another genre. Write us a poem. Yes, a poem about Gods of Boom and Walking Dead collaboration. And let's see who can drop a verse better and who can rhyme best. Now, wait. Now, go to our Discord and join the discussion. Like this video, subscribe and ring the notification bell as there is more news coming to this news station. I am your newscaster, Maya out.